fighting out of Miami, Florida by way of Cotabato City in the Philippines. He weighed in at a ready 135 and three quarter pounds. His record stands at 24 wins, two losses, with 19 big wins coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the hard hitting, ruthless Romero Duno. He is undefeated in his campaign, the ring with a record of 14 wins, no losses, 10 wins coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the rising star of, of the lightweight division, the undefeated Southpaw, Frank the Ghost Martin. You called it, right? I did call yeah. it. It happened in a flash. Yes. <laughs> like a ghost. Or the, or the worldly power here. Duno has won three fights since that loss. To figure him out, you know, touch him a little bit, move, see what he's got, and uh, get out of the way of counters right now. That was ghost-like. He has different speed on his punches, too, Lennox. Sometimes he has a hard stick. Other times he just kind of dusts, and there's a beautiful combination. Yeah, mixing up is very, very important. Opening round in the books. Yeah, skillful, uh, almost, you know, you know, very flexible oh. to be able to do that. Look at that shot again, a little combination, then he ducks out of the way. Again, we're not just waxing poetic. Oh, no. here's our house guy. We love this kid. This kid is earning it, and the more you see him. Yeah, and Martin just got hit on the back of the head in motion to the great ref, uh, veteran ref, Frank Santori, to, you know, keep an eye on it. Nice hard shot there, getting through and breaking through with the guard with the left hand. Martin scoring headshots. Duno now presses forward and tries to answer. They're all really talented. And by the way, the man we saw two weeks ago, Jose Valenzuela, yeah. uh, and, and we saw him back, you know, back to back in Vegas with a Frank Martin fight. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, ferocity that you know he is, sometimes he leaves himself open, but 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 he, he is dangerous yeah, against Martin. Dangerous. Wow, a good right hand by Duno. Uh -huh. Moving in, Martin now clutching. Abbott right, jump out of the way again. Duno is a solid pro. And I've said that I go put him on the run. See, when you got a guy that may not be the good biggest, right hand by Duno, biggest puncher, but a good puncher like Frank, do you got to put him on the run? That landed flush on Frank Martin. So the defensive master is tagged. He looks to his own corner. And you know he went down. That was probably because of oh, oh, oh Martin oh, pushed Duno hand. down clean that time. Five. That's where that speed gets you. That was a sharp, out of nowhere left hand. And look, if Frank Martin's smart, he's going to try to get rid of Duno right here. Trying to do it judiciously. Trying to make yeah. shots and puts him down again. It was the same punch. Yeah. Duno almost out of the ring. He's done. He's done. This 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 Six. is going to be stopped. Seven. It's good to count. Eight. Block me. It's only 10 seconds left in the ring. Very shaky okay. legs. It's over. That's it. That's the right call. Frank Corey it. Jr. calls it. The corner. Duno is in no shape. Corner no, jumped in. Right. It. He yeah. was in no shape. He wasn't balanced on yeah. his feet. His legs were gone. And it was the same punch that caught him. Count Just when he was throwing that right hand, you know, Martin counted, counted him with his left hand. And you know what's more impressive is that Duno came, as you said, he meant business this round, and he was able to land a good hard shot, and then he got whacked. That's a yeah. tremendous performance well, that's, that's by Martin. The, that's the problem. When the guy gets you going, running after him, you're leaving yourself open. Here's the first one. He just steps back, and then bam, counter. See, uh, Duno's weight was coming forward as uh, Frank Martin rocked back and then came back hard with the left-hand counter. Uh, that's, uh, you know, really a dangerous thing. You see him rocking back on that back leg? Now he brings it forward, and oh. Duno was coming forward with all his weight. So the, the momentum of that running into that hard counter punch is doubly hard and when, it was when you make a move like that. Well, it was a... Here you're going to see the second knockdown. Kind of like the same thing. It, Boom. It was the same thing. It was. And it yeah. messed up his equilibrium it did. really bad. He was finding it difficult to get back to oh, his feet. I hate to see that. And you're right. We thought, hey, 10 seconds, maybe he can get out of this round. Yeah. But it, it, uh, immediately you realize it's not worth getting yeah, out of this round no, and continuing. No, no. And I, the corner made the right call. Frank Centauri called it off. Yeah. That was the right. But I like Centauri counting. You can count and then make no, a No, I agree a thousand percent. Let, let me say, the problem with that punch, he committed himself too much. And he was off balance. And then when, he got, when you got caught after that, there was no holding back. Yeah, it, he had you know, to go down. Duno's legs really went out from underneath him. They went wobbly. He's wobbly 
really right now. He's he's in a daze, and it would just gotten much worse. And and I'm glad the corner stopped it. They were right. Well, fans, we have the time of two minutes fifty four seconds in round number four. A referee in charge, Frank Santori Jr., stops the contest upon request of the corner. He is the winner by way of technical knockout. He is still undefeated, Frank the Ghost Martin. Frank Martin, another sensational win. And again, we don't, uh, Joe, you mentioned, we're, we're not part of the family. We're, we, we legitimately think he's a sensational young fighter. So exciting. Saturday, it's a stacked night of heavyweight fights as Luis King Kong Ortiz takes on Prince Charles Martin live and only $39.99. Buy now on the Fox Sports app and watch on any screen you want. Thank you for watching. Well, if you enjoyed that clip, make sure you click uh, somewhere around here and subscribe from Fight Highlights to exclusive interviews. We have got everything you need as a boxing fan right here on PBC on Fox.